Do you love painting your nails? Always booking your next manicure session perhaps, experimenting with different nail paints? Well, you might want to slow it down, especially if you love gel nails. They might come in beautiful colors, but they have a dark side to them. They could give you life-changing allergies. And no, I am not exaggerating this. It's true. Gel nail manicures have their own appeal. They are beautiful. They are sophisticated. One salon visit can keep you covered for the next two or three weeks. But at what cost? You might not know this. Gel nail products contain harmful chemicals. They are called methacrylates. You know how gel nail paints work, right? For those unworst, they are applied in liquid form and then they are hardened under a lamp. And this happens because of the metacrylates. But did you know what else can happen because of them? Skin rashes, peeling skin. Your nail can loosen and could fall off. And in rare cases, you may even develop breathing difficulties. Other severe symptoms include swollen cuticles, sores on your fingers, eczema on the face, around your eyelids, neck, basically wherever your nails touch your body. And once you develop sensitivity to these compounds, there is no going back. It can invite trouble for you down the line. And how is that? You see, the plastics used in gel polishes are similar to those used in dental fillings, joint replacements, cataract treatment, and even in some diabetes treatment. Isn't it too big a risk to take? But why does this even happen? And why has it become so prevalent? Because of the lack of awareness and not following the procedure properly. In fact, toxicologists say that each gel polish formulation is designed to be cured by a specific lamp. And if you don't cure it for the right amount of time, under the right light, the polish will not harden. It will stay liquefied and you will be at a high risk of developing an allergy. And the danger further increases if you frequent a dodgy nail bar. You know, you might find a salon that offers gel manicures at half the price of a luxury one. But these professionals might be mixing and matching different gel products, sourcing budget dupes or not using the right kind of lamp. Budget copycats are produced as cheaply as possible. Sure, they can help you save a few bucks, but they might be bombarded with harmful chemicals. And then there is the recent rise of DIY gel manicures. They became all the rage when people were stuck in their homes during the pandemic. When nail salons were shut and people had all the time to experiment. Most uninformed users buy gel polish from one place and their lamp from another. And they don't realize the importance of carefully matching these two. Also, when you paint your own nails, there is a high chance of getting the product on your skin. And this further increases your chances of developing an allergy. And even if you are doing all the things right, buying the right products, getting a matching lamp, you might still be at a risk of aging your hands. And worse, developing skin cancer. Because not only gel polishes, but the UV lamps as well are dangerous. Ultraviolet light causes damage to the skin cells. Isn't that why dermatologists advise you to wear sunscreen? When you cure your nails under UV lamps, you put them in close contact with harmful radiation. In a study published in the journal Nature Communications, researchers found that exposing skin cells to UV light for 20 minutes killed around 30% of the cells. And those who survived suffered DNA damage. The damage patterns were similar to those observed in melanoma patients. Is that the price you would like to pay for beautiful nails? But this does not mean you can never treat yourself to manicures, of course. Occasional gel nails might not hurt. And not to forget, there are hosts of alternatives in the market. There are dip powder manicures, 
press on nails as well and the good old traditional nail polish. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the updates on the move.